Hello, my name is Zion McArath. I am an Associate Cloud Consultant intern for AWS over summer 2020. And I interviewed Mr. Pesu, who is in the SDE role. And so this video is gonna kind of showcase the questions that I asked and the answers that I uh, received. And so the first question that I asked was, in the SDE role, do you ever get to go beyond coding? Do you ever get to see the business side of things? And Mr. Pesu stated that as a developer, you're always starting with the customer and their needs. So you're gonna be looking at what their problem is and you're gonna be looking at their use cases. And then you're gonna work backwards to figure out that solution. And so that goes back to AWS's customer obsession leadership principle. You're gonna make sure that you're always starting with, well, first figuring out who your customer is, and then you're going to work backwards to curate and develop your solutions based off of that feedback. So then I asked, um, what do you love most about your job? And Mr. Pesu stated that he loved the ability to solve problems and that AWS provides such a plethora of services and tools and technologies that um, you can use and that are right at your fingertips. And so because of that, you have that flexibility to curate these very uh, innovative solutions and these solutions that work best for you and your customer. And so AWS tries to foster that environment um, of being able to experiment and innovate and research. And so um, you're allowed to use the tools and technologies at your fingertips to help your customer. And that's what he stated that he loves the most about it. And that also goes back to AWS's leadership principle of learn and be curious. Um, AWS wants that for their developers. And so they're going to allow you to kind of trinkle a little bit here and there and figure out what this button does. And it, they're going to be able to allow you to use those tools and services to figure out how to best help your customer. And so I also asked, um, how many hours do you work? Do you work a lot of hours? What happens when it comes to, or how do you balance that? Uh, how do you work life? How does, you, how does that work life balance work for you? And he stated that um, when it comes to balancing uh, between work and life, and when it comes to the amount of hours that he works, it's about flexibility. Um, he stated that Usually during the times when things start kicking up and re reinvent is around the corner, you're going to have more of a um, you're going to have more of a workload. So consequently, you're going to work more hours. But once reinvent is done, that workload will kind of go down a little bit, and so you may not be working as much as many hours as you would before. So. It's kind of like um, in school, and there's a difference between your workload in the beginning of the semester when you're first getting settled in your classes, and then at the end of the semester when you're having to finish that huge program and assignment or project that's due and you're trying to get that in. So it's about flexibility when it comes to hours. Also, when it comes to that work-life balance, it's about making sure that um, there's a harmony. and. With AWS, he said that they realize that you're going to have family obligations outside of work. So you're going to be able to say, okay, well, yesterday I worked um, a couple of more hours. So today I'm going to be able to go home and do what I need to do for my family. So it's about harmony and understanding that um, not only you, but other people on your team, they have family obligations and things to do outside of work. So that understanding kicks in with each other. Um, and then the last question I asked was, let me see the last question I asked. What is your job? What is your job like? What are your day-to-day -day responsibilities? And he said that him and his team, it comes to code reviews, um, making sure that you and your team are working towards those milestones that are met, um, making sure that those projects that are followed have gone into your lap, um, they're getting done, those projects are getting done, um, making sure that 
those AWS services are fully functioning. And so basically just uh, making sure that things are running smoothly on the um, developer side of AWS.